Good morning. Welcome to the forecast discussion for Monday, April 22nd, 2024. Of course, I'm your meteorologist, Stephen Martino. Before we begin, first, happy Earth Day. Happy Passover. Passover begins tonight so for those who are celebrating. Happy Passover. And also, just a note that for this week, we're going to have our live chat on Thursday rather than Wednesday, as I have some things to take care of on Wednesday. So we're going to move it to Thursday. I'll also send out an email just to let everyone know and also put it on the premium dashboard, that too. Currently, we are a bit chilly. Temperatures got a chance to fall as skies cleared, winds got light, and we have plenty of dry air at the surface. So that allowed our temperatures to really fall off. But with the sun rising, temperatures are rising rapidly now, re rebounding nicely, ranging from the upper 30s to lower 40s over the northern interior, mid to upper 40s along the coast. Earlier this morning, we were in the upper 20s to mid 30s, aside from southern New Jersey, where we had some more cloud cover and temperatures there stayed in the lower 40s. On our weather tap radar and surface map, you can see not much going on. We have a cold front off to our south and another one off to our north and a high pressure system here in the Mississippi River Valley that is in between and producing tranquil weather conditions all the way to the mid-Atlantic coast. On the visible satellite picture, you can see plenty of clear skies for most of the region down towards southern New Jersey. We have some clouds hanging on as a storm exits out into the Atlantic. It was never a threat for us, but certainly it produced some light rain and continues to produce some light rain down towards North Carolina, but that will all remain off the coast for the rest of the day, as you can see, is exiting out into the Atlantic. The next threat for rainfall is way back here with a cold front that's going to be moving through on Wednesday with a few scattered showers. Nothing heavy, no significant storms, no significant heavy rainfall. Just a very quiet weather pattern with a few passing showers here and there. So not bad at all. Diving into the forecast for today. Sunny skies with temperatures rebounding into the lower to mid 50s over the northern interior. Mid to upper 50s along the coast. And upper 50s to lower 60s in the Delaware River Valley. For tonight into tomorrow morning. Look for clear skies with low temperatures ranging from the upper 20s to lower 30s over the northern interior. Mid to upper 30s along the coast, there will still be that threat for frost and freeze considerations, especially freeze condition considerations for the higher elevations, the suburbs, some frost. So if you have any plants, you definitely want to protect them during this period as we will have temperatures fall off uh, into rather chilly conditions. Tomorrow afternoon, sky cloud cover, temperatures rebounding again ranging from the mid to upper 50s on the immediate coast, lower to mid 60s everywhere else. On Wednesday, there goes that cold front moving through with scattered showers. Again, not looking for anything heavy, just a passing shower here and there. Look for temperatures to range from the lower to mid 40s over the northern interior, mid to upper 40s in your suburbs, upper 40s to lower 50s in your urban areas. The cold front will continue to move through in the afternoon with scattered showers and look for temperatures to rebound into the lower to mid 50s on the immediate coast, mid to upper 50s away from the coast. On Thursday, high pressure will build in with clear skies and tranquil conditions. Look for low temperatures again, rather chilly in the mid to upper 20s over the higher elevations, upper 20s to lower 30s over the northern interior and mid to upper 30s along the coast. High temperatures will range from the lower to mid 50s over the interior and along the coast, upper 50s to lower 60s in the Delaware River Valley. On Friday, high pressure will be in place with sky cloud cover expected. Look for low temperatures in the lower to mid 30s. High temperatures will range from the mid to upper 50s on the immediate coast, upper 50s to lower 60s everywhere else. On Saturday, we're going to have a frontal boundary hang around the region. Now, basically what's happening is that we have a maritime air mass trying to push south, and we have this low-pressure system lifting up through the central Great Lakes that's going to try to drive a warm front northward. The combination of these two will lead to increasing cloud cover throughout the region, possibly an isolated shower here and there, with low temperatures in the mid to upper 30s over, the north, over much of the region for lows, and high temperatures ranging from the mid to upper 50s on the immediate coast, upper 50s to lower 60s over the interior, and lower to mid 60s in the Delaware River Valley. On Sunday, 
Look for that frontal boundary to hang around the region with variable cloud cover and isolated showers. Look for low temperatures in the upper 40s to lower 50s. High temperatures will be much warmer as that frontal boundary will be to the north of the region. But just a little bit of a warning here. The position of this frontal boundary will be very important. If it actually ends up stalling out, let's say around Philadelphia, these high temperatures will be cooler. So to what to expect here? Well, lower to mid 60s around Long Island and Connecticut, upper 60s to lower 70s over the interior and down through the New York City metro, which includes northeastern New Jersey. Then as you head down towards the Philadelphia metro in central and southern New Jersey, temperatures will range from the mid to upper 70s. On Monday, that front boundary will remain to the north of the region, hanging out right about here, with variable cloud cover and a few isolated showers here and there. Look for low temperatures to range from the mid to upper 50s. High temperatures will range from the upper 70s to lower 80s in the northern interior, lower to mid 80s along the coast, and mid to upper 80s in the Delaware River Valley. That is your forecast discussion for today. Have a wonderful day, and as always, stay safe out there.